So we continue our Belgian tour with the 13th century Gothic church for Our Lady with its 115 meter tower. My thoughts have never been clearer. Here are buried Charles the Bold and his daughter, the Duchess Mary. Michelangelo's Madonna and the Child cannot be seen unless you buy the museum tickets. We then went to visit the first only museum dedicated to potato fries. Did you know that there are around 5,000 potato species and that the first potato came to Europe from Peru through Portugal? Believe it or not, this cone of rice made it to space. A huge step for all the potatoes out there. After fighting some wire worms and white grubs, as well as hearing the fire song, we came to know how the American soldiers during World War II thought that the Belgian soldiers who offered them fries we're French, and this is how they got the wrong name, French fries. We ended our visit with the true taste of fries. I think we'll be we had to visit next another museum dedicated to a famous product of Belgium, beer. Black expression here, you can discover how beer is made by boiling water with hops, then adding malt, yeast, and spices before fermenting. Don't be afraid to search for the hidden questions and take the quiz. If you get the full ticket option, you get to taste whatever three beers you'd like. Blonde, dark, fruity, whatever you wish. We left the capital city for Sunday, and whoever says Brussels has to visit the mannequin piss, although you might get surprised by its size. After a quick sneak peek of the Grand Place, we discovered Maison d'Ondois and Another worldwide famous attraction, the Atomium, which was created by Jean and André Polak for the Exposition Universelle of 1958. It is 102 meters high and is based on an iron atom, and its architecture is quite complex. We saw a beautiful light show. Yeah. 
Look at the breathtaking view of Brussels. I couldn't help myself. I had to buy some fries before dinner. Honestly, I've never liked fries outside of Belgium ever since. So back to the Grand Place for having some local dishes and saying goodbye to this beautiful city. <laughs> Yeah, I'm going to go to the zoo.